know this is wrong and you want to do something about it. Even if it's just highlighting the fact that veterans are being deported because your dad was a great part of that, that's, that's, that, that's enough. Uh, but we need more. We need we need a uh, we need our legislators, officials, to get out their hands and start saying that you know we love our veterans, but at the same time leaving us here to to die. I don't want to go home in a body bag because a lot of people don't know that if I died right now, I can actually go back and be buried in a veteran cemetery near my home. So I have to die to go back. It doesn't make any sense. We've had guys die already, and they're back home, buried in America. So do I have to die to go back home? Uh, no, I don't want to die to go back home. I want to go home my life. I want to see my kids. I want to see my grandkids. I want, I want what every, everybody else wants to, you know, in America. You know, the American dream, I've had it, and, and I'm still living it now. But I'm an American, and I don't deserve to be here. My people don't like me. My people are freaking assholes that cause me because of their freaking racism. They're racist against me. You know, my own people, excuse my friend, no, my own people practice some racist against me because I'm a pocho, I'm a pinch American. You know, they charge me more, they charge me like, the, like this guy, they charge me just like him. They're kind American, porque, you know, the, the way we talk, and the, you know, I'm an American. Yes, I was born in Michoacan 58 years ago, but, I, you know, I was in America for three years old. I am an American. You know, that's what everybody here is trying to make you understand. We're Americans just like you. And, and this isn't our home. This isn't our home. Yes, we're making do because we're military men. We improvise and adapt. We've adapted. No. We don't like it. No. But we've had to make do until more people like yourself decide to say enough. Let's stand up. Let's do the right thing and bring our men home. We're going to be here. And like I said, I don't want to go home in a body bag. I've sent several guys already back home. Mm -hmm. Our organization has sent guys dead in a body bag in a little cremation thing. And it's all your time. And we're saying enough, bring us home, you know, or help us come home. You're like a little one of the shining beacon light. Line here, right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here.